I mean, how can you go wrong with Shakespeare, the Beatles, and wrestling? I think this story is lovely because of the nature of love at first sight is explored in this. And it's really, really powerful. I, Rosalind takes that feeling and then she's like, and this is how I will pursue this love very strongly. I don't think we see that quite often. So it's just like this full expression of love um, that just continues on the story and the journey that, that we all go on with. There will also be music being played, Beatles music. Because the Beatles are Shakespearean in nature within their text and within their music, it actually fits seamlessly with As You Like It. I think people are going to experience a really smooth transition from Shakespeare's text to songs that just like, they just meld so well together. It's like in a musical, they reach an emotional high and the only thing they can do is sing. <laughs> and so I think that's how it's structured is that at those moments where the intensity and emotions are high, people burst into songs, it's very much a musical thing. It's interesting because taking Shakespeare and living within the Jimi Hendrix era, within the tie-dye, within, the, um, within the, the free love movement. And for me, that access point is a lot more fun. When I think about the 60s, I think about this powerful use of our voice. And, and I love that Rosalind does that in the story too. She really uses her voice in a very strong way. And I, I'm just excited to do that as a woman, as a black woman. Um, I feel like Rosalind is a very powerful being. If you cannot find something in this production to enjoy, since it's Shakespeare, so if you like Shakespeare, you're gonna like it. If you're a music person and a Beatle fan, you're gonna like it. And if you're a wrestling fan, you're gonna like it. And there's actually a big chunk of, of, of wrestling in it. I think people will really enjoy it. And it'll be good for the soul.